Oh, I, I've never believed it's constructive to negotiate publicly. What you have to say in a negotiation is best said directly. Uh, and I've always tried to be very forthright and transparent in terms of how we're focused on things because I don't think surprises make sense. And if I have something to say to Don, I don't want him to have to read about it. I'd rather say it to him directly. I think every time you have any type of negotiation between two parties, those are the two parties that should be talking and it should not be through media or uh, a third party because there's a lot of things that get twisted and uh, the more time a story get, gets told, you know, something will change a little bit. So if you can stick to just talking to the other side and, and, and uh, I think it's easier to get to the right, right answers and, and solutions. It's probably the way it should be. And I think that's probably a good sign that uh, there is some mutual respect and, and uh, uh, both sides are trying to come to agreements where there maybe isn't any. And uh, uh, there's some yeah, mutual dedication to, to keeping our game going on down the same path and not disrupting that. I think part of it may be, at least from our side, Unlike prior years where there were fundamental changes that were needed, very fundamental changes, um, the issues that we would be focused on, we've decided are important, but less important than labor peace and less important than having a disruption that we think stability and having a framework to move forward is more important in the short term than any of the issues. We